everyone this is recess realness with miss nicole tyler how are y'all doing out there today okay let me put out this little bit of news that just came to me about an hour or two ago sean bradley and the best that i got mm-hmm sean bradley has unsubscribed from the best that i got and he said there is no beef okay he said it's over he has unsubscribed and that's the end of that so if anything else is going to be popping off it's not going to be popping off from his channel it's going to be popping off from her channel okay but i'm still going to be listening to the youtube streets now let's get into jay wilson's hair piece what do miss nicole tyler has to say about jay wilson and that damn hair piece y'all first of all i was shocked as hell when he got it okay now I'm not surprised that he got the hair piece because guess what? Howdy Snowfly been telling y'all that he's going to get a hair piece. Now, if y'all been listening to Howdy Snowfly, she been telling y'all that she think that he's going to get some hair on his head. Whether it's a wig or hair weave or man weave. But guess what? He got a man weave. Now, it is like, you know, the top is full. It has a fade and a part. Now, do I like it? No, I don't like it because I think that... It is too round for his head. I think that he was very attractive as a bald head gay man. But guess what else I have to tell y'all. See, this is not about me and you or the YouTube streets. This is about a coin for Jay Wilson. And it is also... Now, first of all, Jay Wilson, his platform is mostly being supported by straight black women. Okay? He has like 99.9% .9 of, of straight black women on his channel. And all of those women that support him like his bald head, okay? They think he's very handsome with a bald head. And that's why he came out and said that he was bisexual when he is really gay. Because he doesn't want to lose his female audience. So, Jay Wilson is very smart and intellectual. And he's thinking, okay, if all these black women think that I'm handsome with a bald head and I am mainly attracted to only men then I have to go against that I have to do what the young men are doing today now Jay Wilson is not interested in no damn body his age okay he is you he is into young men that's what I said that's what I truly believe I truly believe Jay Wilson is into young men now if Jay Wilson is going to compete out here and get him a young man he cannot be single and bald because that's what black women like okay I don't know a lot of uh, gay men that really is into bald heads okay I have a lot of gay male friends and most of all my gay male friends they have beards and they have hair and, and they're not bald okay so I don't know what that is about but I'm just telling y'all that Jay Wilson wants to compete out here for a younger man um, if you look at uh, Armand Wiggins, now Armand Wiggins is what, 25 years old? He's a good looking man. He has, he has beautiful teeth. You know, he had braces, but he has beautiful, he's a beautiful guy. And, Jay, and uh, Armand Wiggins is always changing his hair color. And I think that Howdy Fly was hinting to something. She sees something that we didn't see, that I didn't see, that Jay Wilson really is going to be changing his hair color soon. That's what I choose. Jay Wilson wants him a younger man. And the and in my opinion, the men that Jay Wilson likes is either light skinned, fair skinned, or white. He doesn't want no dark skinned person. Okay, I picked that up. I picked that up by him saying that he liked Heidi's cat over my hips. Okay, because I'm brown skinned. I'm a brown skinned woman, and Heidi Flat is a light skinned woman who's married to a white man. So he feels that that's more of his speed, that light-skinned kind of cat, okay? Even though we know Jay Wilson does not like cat, we know that he li what he likes. Mm -hmm. Now, so if Jay Wilson dates a dark-skinned man, they're going to have to have money for Jay Wilson. That's just what I feel. I feel like if he dates anybody his complexion or darker, they need to have money. But he really is after a white man, a fair-skinned man, or a light-skinned man. And he wants to be able to compete. He does not want to be bald because that's what black men, women like. Black women like bald-headed. Now, I would not be surprised if Jay Wilson got him a breast lift or chest lift. I wouldn't be surprised if he did something strange for some change because I know that Jay Wilson is into his looks. And he wants to get out there to compete because he is a lonely, single black man living inside a big damn house just him so he puts it out to y'all that he isn't lonely i don't believe that i believe he is very lonely that's why he got that hair and pretty soon he's gonna dye it it's gonna be blonde that's what i believe we'll see 
But I believe that he just really wants to compete with the young man. He wants to get him a young man. The young man has to be white, fair skin, or light skin. No dark men unless you have some damn money for Jay Wilson. Okay. Also, if you will remember, the only reason why Jay Wilson was dealing with Wiley in the beginning is because of Armand Wiggins. Now, Armand Wiggins is an attractive man, but he has a boyfriend, okay? And Jay Wilson probably would have hit on Armand Wiggins if he hasn't already, but he has a man. So, sorry, Jay Wilson. You're stuck <laughs> with the likes of Wiley. ZT. So you was dealing with Wally, and when you found out all the shenanigans that Wally, he just comes with a lot of baggage. You know, Jay Wilson don't need nobody who's been on the news for for uh, abusing a, li a library. So that's why Jay Wilson, after he found all of that out and all that shenanigans that uh, Wally is about, then Wally catfish Jay Wilson. Cha. Child, Wally ain't had no damn job, no car. He's on the bus. He homeless. He ain't afraid to sell his body. He, he, he didn't tore up the library talking about some image Hill, and he ain't afraid to get in the ass. Chad J. Wilson was like, oh, hell to the no and no to the hell. Because that's why J. Wilson is always beefing with ZT and Wiley. And here recently, Castro Cannon, he, oh, I'm just going to give Castro Cannon um, some advice and a, a number to a lawyer. Really, J. Wilson? Now you have a whole damn head full of hair. Because you're single and you're lonely. And you're living in a big damn house by yourself. Mm -hmm. A big, big, big house that you wanted to live in. You don't have any kids. So now you're like, okay, I have all these women saying that they like me. I'm good looking because I'm bald. But what do my, my people want me to have so that I can stop being single in 2019? Mm -hmm. CJ Wilson, that's what I peeped out about you. That you really like young, young men. Mm -hmm, in their 20s mm -hmm. and you don't like dark skinned men and if they are dark they have to have some money that's the only way you're going to deal with them that's what I think y'all what do y'all think this is Nicole Tyler recess alright y'all <laughs> tell me what y'all think about this Jay Wilson and his new damn hair piece honey is Jay Wilson's hair piece bringing all the boys to the yard boys coming to his yard is the boys coming to his yard Jay Wilson, is your hair piece bringing all the boys to the yard? Bringing all the boys to the yard? Bringing all the boys to the yard?